Hello, today I'm going to show you how to free up space on your SSD. First, go to Recycling Bin, right click and select Properties. See how your local disk C will be selected and is where the recycling bin is stored. Use custom size, the maximum size is in megabytes. By default it's probably a gigabyte, but you can make it to 500 megabytes which is half a gigabyte. I just have it to 100 because that's enough for me and it will save you some space. But warning, don't select like this because all your files will be deleted and apply. The next most obvious thing to do is install programs and software on a separate drive if possible. For example, I download software on this drive and I store like one game on this drive as well as the operating system. So just make sure you select separate drive whenever you can. Another way to significantly save space is to disable the hibernation feature. To do this, go to the star button and type CMD. Press enter. Now type power CFG dot exe space slash hibernate off. Now it won't do anything for me because I've already done it, but it will work for you. You may have to run as administrator before this feature would work, so I will do it again as an administrator. power cfg.exe space slash hibernate off and that worked so if it doesn't work when you're not running as an administrator make sure you right click and run as administrator and it will surely work for you final method of saving space on an SSD is by creating symbolic links to different drives. To do this, type in CMD and type MKLink. Here it will give you different examples of the different types of symbolic links you can make. For example, if I want to store test onto drive D and it was originally on drive C, I will have to input desired location first after typing mklink again. Then you will input the original location space and paste that. Then you can press enter and you will have a symbolic link to a different directory and the computer will think that's on your other drive and it won't take up any space on the drive that's actually on so you can confuse the computer and make it appear on another drive. So these are a few ways of saving space on an SSD. Thanks for watching.